This is my initial implementation of XPBD. To simulate stiff materials, I uh, use sequential constraint updates. And to reduce the bias that that comes with, I alternate between uh, iterating my constraints forwards and backwards, as well as I avoid iterating chains of constraints where their endpoints coincide with each other. XPBD introduces a cool um, parameter called compliance, which allows the simulation of softer, stretchier materials and allows the behavior to be consistent with different time steps. This way, I can vary the time step uh, for faster moving uh, frames as well. And one th cool thing I uh, noticed is that it can do kind of a slinky effect. Here's a really old video of mine to show you what it might look like once it's integrated with liquid layers. Back then, I did not have much web experience, so I didn't know how to set up a database so that people could create and share their um, little structures and creations. I now have my main physics building blocks as well as a synth. So uh, soon, I hope to launch a site that allows you to create with liquid layers and uh, compose music and share it. Thanks for watching.